Hi there and welcome back to How to Use Anna 2. We're going to continue on with our sound design course and we're going to be doing a simple sort of garage style FM bass. So um, we've got an initiated preset and we're going to just click right on our waveform display to get to a sign on our first oscillator. And we'll do the same on our second oscillator. And what we're going to do is just add a bit of FM from oscillator 2 to oscillator 1. Um, to create that sort of garage bass sound. So in oscillator 2 we want to turn our voices to 1 and that enables the voice um, but we can turn it down because we don't actually want this waveform coming through as a regular oscillator. We only want to use this as our FM source. So we go back to 1 and select our source which is oscillator 2 which is what we want and now we can hear there that the FM is working. So what we want to do is assign this to an envelope so we right click and we can select mod envelope 1 and then once it's assigned to that we can check it's assigned if we go into our mod matrix which it is and then we can use our depth control to start adding some depth and then we'll create just a standard um, sort of shape here we we'll use our analog one that's fine bring the curve down maybe a bit and we can just bring the octaves down on our oscillator one just to get it into the sort of bass region. Now it's far too extreme. Our depth is way too high there. Um, so that's sounding pretty good. And we can play with the, the curve here to get different vibes if we want a sort of more attacky sound. Or we can ease off and get a sort of more smooth sound. The other thing you may want to do is turn retrig on on both OSCs. And again, you can play about with this depth, just depend on how much of a twang you want of it. So there we go, there's a garage style FM bass. In the next video we're going to be looking at a sort of FM slap bass, an 80s vibe um, twangy bass. Thanks everybody for watching, commenting and indeed liking. We really do appreciate all the support we get here on our Sonic Academy YouTube channel. So if you find this video super useful, please We'd love you to hit the subscribe button. We update the uh, YouTube channel every week with new content. And if you want to watch some more relevant content, just click on the videos beside me.